Exactly that, don't they? Well, it's funny you should say that. Funny Gabby Rosling, say that? pro. Uh, if you're looking to drop a few pounds, it's time now to meet a great bunch of lads who have managed to create one of the most successful weight management schemes of all time. Listen to this: ninety-five percent of the participants have lost weight. How? Let's find out. Millions of us love a kickabout. Oh. 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 Every time in rehearsal, back of the net. Typical. Oh. We all love a kickabout and getting that thrill of nearly scoring a goal. But if, uh, <laughs> what about if you were to mix kickabouts with losing weight, effectively gamifying exercise? Well, joining me now, Terry Dowling, Ryan Curtis, Ben and Andy Gallen from Man vs Fat Football League. <laughs> Good to see you. You're the project project leader. You're the coach. How does this work? Tell me all about it. So, I mean, Mandy Fat originally came from the idea that men were struggling to find support for losing weight and kind of tired and bored of sitting in these these uh, these groups that are already there. These existing uh, approaches where you can talk about your. Uh, post baby weight, or you could talk about your desire to get your little black dress for Christmas. And generally speaking, in those groups, typically it's like one or two guys and the rest Absolutely. of it. Absolutely. Yeah, really dominated by women. And I think the once, uh, so our creator, Andy Shanahan, when he, once he looked for more focus male focus weight loss uh, support it was staggering how little there was okay so okay this is based around football but what makes it different from just a five aside or seven aside league so the 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 goals that people are scoring the wins are incentivized by people's weight loss not yeah. by how much they lose but how consistently they can come in and lose weight so players any players in the country uh, any men that are overweight but want to lose weight they come in they sign up they do they sign up to uh manlyfat.com forward slash football and then they're put into a team in a league near there and from that league, they're put into a team of 10 players, and each week they meet a coach. They will be weighed as a team, and the goals scored on the scales combined with the goals scored. So you get pitch. points not just from scoring goals, but of meeting your goals of losing weight as you yeah. go along. Yeah, absolutely. That's fantastic. And, and you're working together as a team. Yeah, and that's what the guys are really attributing the success to, is the, the guys on their team. So, Ryan, you're a relatively new sort of signee. Yeah, up yeah to I started thing. three weeks ago. How's, yeah, it working out? Weeks. How's it working out? So far, so good. Yeah. I've lost weight all three weeks uh, that I've been so far, which for me is, is pretty massive, to be fair, because for about four years before that, it was going up, 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 up. Every Have week, you tried so. other things as well, other ways of doing it? No. <laughs> so, <laughs> no so this is your first... Your no, first to, be, to be fair, uh, it, wasn't the, it wasn't the weight loss thing that, that drew me to man be fat. I was much more interested in trying to find a way that I could go and play a little bit of football and... Me going and joining an 11 side team is just too daunting. Just haven't got the fitness for it. Pitch is too big. I can't, I can't make it around that. Uh, and how so stumbled across. It, does it make a difference that everybody else there is is it on the same level? You know, you're you're all trying to achieve the same thing together. Massive, yeah, massive. I'm I'm, I'm still chasing shadows, but they're they're bigger shadows now. Big big boys. Yeah. Um, and, uh, <laughs> um, no, it, it it really does. I think I think it takes the daunting sort of anxious aspect away yeah. from it. You're all in the same boat. And, I mean, Ben and Andy, you're further down the road. How long have you been part of the league for? We both started in January. In January? And tell me a story. How's it worked out for you so far? Uh, well, for me, it's been a real life changer. I had knee surgery two or three years ago, just before Christmas. I'd, I'd realised just how big I'd got. My knee was really suffering. I thought I was going back for another operation. But I was pretty sure if I went back to the doctors in the state I was in, he was just going to tell me I was too heavy. So obviously I shifted the weight before I went back to the doctors. And before going back to the doctors, my knee problems went away. So it's massively affected my health. And the fact you're both brothers. Yeah. I mean, Andy, I know that you've done incredibly on this. Tell us what you've achieved since you've been... Yeah, so when I joined Christmas, I was 20 stone, so... Oh, wow. 20 stone? Yeah, so I'm down to 14 now. And, and wow. It, the... oh, wow. <laughs> Crucially, it's a social thing as well. So yeah, so, so when you're in a team of 10 lads, you don't want to let the team down by not losing weight because it could mean you lose the game. So especially the competitions, had my brother on the team, wanted to make sure I'd beat him. Because so. I'm a better footballer as well, he had to do it off the screen. <laughs> 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 this, is, this is where it starts. Well, listen, it's so good to have you here, guys. And we can't have footballers, footballers and a, a makeshift goal standing in the studio without a penalty shootout, can we? Yeah! yeah. Ben, Andy and Ryan of Man Vs Fat against the Saturday Show team of Kel, Gabby and Edith. Best of three penalties. Aston's in goal. He's got the gloves and everything. Yeah. In you go, Aston. Brilliant. Tony's going to be doing the commentary. Terry, on this ball occasion, boys. you're the ball boy. And I...
have got the whistle, which means I'm the referee. Are we ready? We're going oh, right. to... We're going to start that. first. Uh, we're going to start with you, Andy. Step up, place the ball on the spot. Go on, Andy. Come on, Andy. Come on, Andy. Come on, Andy. Versus fat. Who's stepping up first? Oh, Kel. Yeah, Take a ball, stick it on the oh, spot. Oh, 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 Shall we call it at that point? Because I think that's too much. Oh, I want to that's too much. Oh, oh, we have to let Gabby. We have to let Gabby take one. Oh, oh. No goal. No goal. Well, I think I think we can't. We don't want to take this any further. It's, it's a disgrace. The winner of the first ever Saturday show football penalty shootout <laughs> is the proper footballer. Yeah. It's traditional. It's handed over by Tony Hadley. Well well now, well after the break. I can't, I can't imagine you being 27, mate. You look fantastic. Yeah, there we there go. There you go, chaps. Well done. Well done. Yeah. Here we go. Yeah. After the break, the north of England meets the south of Italy to inspire your weekend dinner tables. Joe Hurd knocks up his delicious whole gnocchi 